Okay, so Rolex's The Hunt event starts tomorrow, so I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I need to know and how to prepare for the hunt tomorrow. So yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so I'm currently on the official Rolex page, which is down here. So you just click on it and it'll lead you here. And now you can actually join, like, the hub, but if you join it, it's just like a countdown. But here, as you can see, explore the infinite vault. This hunt will take you into the infinite vault where you'll find futuristic treasures collected through Roblox space and time. In the infinite vault, what's old is new and what's new is old. Have you traveled forwards or backwards in time? Which way you go does not matter. Only how many treasures you gather. And then it has this picture here of a ton of portals. And these are going to be the portals to teleport, in you, to teleport you into all of the participating games. So this is basically going to be a death hunt. And then there's this. Complete challenging quest. Ready to prove yourself meta. Dive through an array of portals to find adventures and badges. And then there's this picture here which shows like a battle pass. And then there's a blue track and then you can see that there's a gold track that you can unlock which we'll get into that in a bit. And also you can see what seems to be a murder mystery 2 badge so it might be confirming that it's also going to be in the hunt. And then here you see collect epic rewards. The vault is full of rare and elusive items and your badges are the key to unlocking them. Can you get them all before the vault door closes forever? And there's just some questions here and another teleport to the hub. There's currently 104 games that are confirmed to be in the hunt. And hold on, let me show you guys something. Okay, so here are the badges. For all the items. I just zoomed in so it might be a little bit blurry, but for a pendant, you need 5 badges. For the staffs, you need 20 badges. The wings, 40 badges. The hoods are 60 and the crowns are 95. So that means you're going to have to get even more and more badges in different games. And each game is worth one badge, so once you complete the quest in that game, you'll get one badge. So that means you're gonna have to go into 95 different games to get the crown. And on top of this, there's also gold versions of everything, which is gonna be unlocked in the gold track. Currently, I think the gold track is gonna be like 6 to 700 Robux, I'm not sure. But there is a way to get it for free, so let me show you. Okay, so this is a Corblox Deathwalker, so it's 29,000 Robux, but Roblox has a new thing where if you own this bundle, then you get the gold track for free. So basically, they're rewarding people who buy this. And if you don't know, this is also going to be going on off sale on March 31st. Okay, I'm currently loading into the game hub and... Wait, what? Oh, okay, so it's basically just showing that it's not starting yet. And here is a countdown for the event. So the event starts tomorrow, March 15th, and then it's going to end Saturday, March 30th. So this event is going to last 15 days, and then you're going to have 15 days to get every single badge, and then to get all of the items that you want. But now let me show you some of the games that are going to be participating, and how to prepare for them. Okay, so RV Battles here tweeted something. And they said, when the timer is right, answers will be revealed. Join us in the hunt this Friday, March 15th. So yeah, they're going to be a part of the hunt, and this is going to be, well, their game icon. And if we go over here to their Twitter page, they also tweeted something else. They also tweeted this trailer. Basically, you can't really tell what it is. But it's going to be teasing the hunt tomorrow. Endor has also tweeted something. As you can see here, they tweeted a video basically just showing the event. Because they're also going to be a part of the hunt. And it's going to be the backdoor update. And basically, it's just going to be another event like the April Fool's event. Oh yeah, and I just noticed. If you go to the right, you're going to see that Roblox the hunt is actually trending. So that shows how much people are actually caring about this, because it's been 4 years I think since the last Roblox event. Okay, I just saw this and it turns out that Arsenal is also going to be a part of the hunt. And they're going to be having another event which seems to be like an RB Battles type event like how they did last year. I mean two years ago for the RB Battles Season 3 event. Okay, now there's a lot of other games that are going to be a part of the event. And I'm going to be quickly listing some of them. So first up we have Pet Simulator 99. They actually tweeted about this the other day and well I'm pretty excited for this one but what I think it's going to be. And I'm going to be quickly showing you guys how to prepare. So if you go here into your items and you scroll down. If you're a participator, of course, you're going to see this mystery key. And basically what I think is going to be is that 
they've been working on this for a few months and it's gonna be and Mr. Kirvan is actually gonna be a part of the Roblox hunt. So yeah, they might finally let us use them tomorrow. And we'll probably get something good, a badge, maybe some items in game, and it'll help contribute to getting more items in the Roblox event. Some other games are gonna be like Bed Wars, Piggy, I think Jailbreak might be a part of it. There's gonna be the Tower Defense Simulator, I think Toilet Tower Def I think Toilet Tower Defense Simulator, whatever it's called. And then I'm pretty sure Brookhaven Blade Ball, Death Ball, and some other games are gonna be a part of it. And if you want the full list, here you go. There's actually a ton of pages. As you can see, there's 3008 Adopt Me, there's Arsenal, Arm Wrestle Simulator, and then just a ton of other ones. There's actually 114 confirmed games right now. So here you go. And something I'm not excited for is Sonic Speed Simulator and SpongeBob Simulator. Because if you don't know, these are actually made by GameFam, and well, they're not really a nice company, and they're probably going to make this pay to win like usual. But hopefully not, let's just hope that it's free to play. Other than that, just to prepare, there's no actual way to prepare. But in some of those games I see, you can actually try to prepare a little bit. And basically how you do that is just play the game, and for games like Oh, But You're On A Bike, which is also a part of it, you basically just play that game until you get pretty good so you can get the badge quickly. And in some other simulator games, you can just play until you get like some good pets. Or whatever the stats are in that game. And after that, hopefully it'll make your progress during the hunt way faster. But yeah, other than that, there's no actual way to prepare. So basically just playing the game a little bit beforehand and then seeing what it's actually about is actually going to help you out a ton. But, but there's probably no way to just prepare for it instantly or get the badge instantly after preparing for a little bit. But some games that you actually can't prepare in are just... Well, simulator games and then but yeah basically you can just prepare in simulator games and other games you can just play them a little bit see what it's about and then look at their twitter maybe and then hopefully you'll get some hints on what you can do but yeah other than that that's basically it there's nothing else and i don't think there's anything else that i need to say but yeah if you have some other tips to help me out or anybody else that's going to be struggling during the event be sure to let me know in the comments but yeah that's pretty much going to be it for this video I'm going to be streaming the event tomorrow, and it's going to start at 10 a.m. PST. And I'm going to be—I'm probably going to start streaming like 30 minutes before then. So yeah, if you want to join me during this event, I'm going—I'm probably going to try getting every single badge during it. So yeah, make sure to join the live stream if you want to. Anyways, that's going to be for this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to subscribe. And anyways, I'll see you on the next video. So yeah, bye.